Welcome back. Thanks so much for get, coming back to us and joining us again here at the Pen and Ink Well. Really good to see you all again and to have this chance to share some more pens with you. Really excited today. I've got... Um, this is a pen that's been on my wish list for a little while. Um, I've shown you and I've tried many different versions, so let's just cut to the chase before I ramble on a little bit and um, people sort of say that, you know, you don't know what I'm talking about for a while. So I'm looking at the Caveco and this is another of the sport range. I've done a few, so you can have a look at, you know, more of the sport range in videos that I've got, sort of, you know, if you subscribe to the channel, have a look at my other videos. I've done the Brass Sport, I've done the Skyline and I've done the Ice Sport. I've done the AC Sport, um, the carbon fibre version. So now this is the, really, the only one left in that series, really. Um, and this is the AL, the Caveco AL Sport. So this is the one made of aluminium. And since I went over to visit Caveco and I went to the um, to one of the trade fairs there, and I met up with some lovely people and one of the Caveco stockists um, in, in Europe, another part of Europe, and he had a black one. And he had a black one and a pencil in a little case. And ever since then, I've really fancied having a look at this AL because I love the finish on them. Really nice and a really good price point for what is a very nice solid pen. So let me have a look. And I've also, I've got a giveaway that I'm going to be running at the end of this video. I'm going to give you the details of the giveaway right at the end of the video. And I'll post the details down below as well. I'll push a reminder on my Instagram account, but this will have a giveaway linked to it and a closing date sort of attached to that. So here we go. So this is the Caveco AL. And, or this, more to the point, is the Caveco AL. And I got it in blue. I really fancied the blue colour. I really like the blue. If it came in red, I think I'd like the red, but I do like this blue. And then I went and got a matching pencil to go with it. So I've got a few bits and bobs. I actually keep it in this little black case that I've pinched off my daughter. I'm really desperately trying to find a clear one, but they don't make them anymore. So if anybody knows of where I can still find one, please do let me know. Excuse me. But also I wanted to take this opportunity to tell you about a couple of other features that Caveco have brought out recently. This being one of them. So this is a new pen pouch and this is the, the two pen holder and it's made of denim. It comes in black, which is what this one is, and it comes in blue as well. This is what I'm going to be giving away at the end of this video. These cost, here in the UK, these retail at 26 99 and they hold, so they hold two of the any of the Caveco Sport Series. You also get two or three, lit, well certainly three Lily Puts in here as well would fit as well. However, as I say, they're designed to hold two Cavecos. I hold the fountain and the pencil in mine, but they, they'll, they'll hold two of any any of that sort of range. Um, and then I've got the clip, which have been around for a little while. But also, when I go through this, I'm also going to show you the new converter. There is finally a piston converter that has been made for the sport, which makes such a difference. Up till now, I'd really only used... I'd either refilled cartridges with a syringe or just used cartridges because there was a squeeze converter but it didn't hold an awful lot of ink and it didn't pull up drawing a lot of ink to be able to sort of fill it properly really. So a few things to look at. So we've got the, the pen, the blue AL pen, fountain pen. I've got fine nib on this one. I've got the pencil to look at. We've got the piston filler converter in the sport with the clip and then we've got the beautiful new denim pouch and right at the end details of the giveaway okay so thank you very much for joining me come back in just a few seconds where we'll turn the camera around and we'll look at it in more detail bye welcome back and thank you for joining me now to have a look at this complete collection of various Caveco items to go with this sport range so I'm going to take a bit of the time and show you everything and then I'll give you details of the giveaway right at the end so here we go. So what I've got here is the Caveco AL Sport fountain pen in blue. And I've got the pencil here as well, again in blue. 
I've got the new denim pouch in black as it turned out and I've got the case that the, both of these pens would come in exactly the same case and I'll show you that as well and then the clip the optional clip so you can buy to go with these so let's take it all apart so we'll go from the start then if you purchase these pens they come with these I love these you've seen them before beautiful tin cases the pens lie in there you could actually I find them really functional you could they're very good then to carry around because you could you can keep two in there so if you want to carry the pen around you could keep and take your pens with you in there so worth having nice beautiful Quebeco tints I've got a few of them lying around now so they come in useful so let's have a look we'll have a look at the fountain pen then we'll have a look at the pencil and then I'll tell you about the case from there so this is the AL both the fountain pen and the pencil made of the same material but if you have a look bit of a sort of bugbear I suppose or a couple of things um, and this is just me being completely ridiculously picky however the blues are different the fountain pen is a lighter shade from the pencil um, which is a little annoying um, I don't have a preference from one to the other but they are slightly different um, and then the other thing then this sounds daft that I sort of feel that that's the front of the pen and that's the front of the pencil so I sort of would expect this writing to go the same way I want them sort of in line so either this pencil one needs to go the other way to go in line with that or vice versa so in order to get them both read in the right way up they have to go the opposite way again just picky if you're like me if you sort of notice the tiny little things so the fountain pen these are little pens they are the sport series is a little pen and they're designed to be so and you know they are ideal for what the purpose that they serve so this is the AL in blue and this is a fine nib pen and weight wise it's 24 grams so it's not heavy but it is heavier than the obviously the plastic skylines or the ice sports it's a nice size but it's a nice weight without the cap then it's just 12 grams but this cap will always be on it's very difficult to write with without it possible but not for an awful long time the pencil weighs 27 grams as it is and that is always how this will stay so this is a obviously a lead pencil but I'll show you how it's a mechanical pencil this one there is a clutch pencil as well but this is a mechanical version which is my preference um, they also come in a roll they also comes in a ball pen as well so um, there is a full series available um, lengthwise 105 millimeters as you're looking at it now and it's 100 millimeters without the cap and 131 millimeters posted which is how you would write with this so let's have a look in sort of detail so we've got the Caveco cap logo here at the end we've got Caveco AL Sport Germany written across here and then we've got this sort of hexagonal shape to this pen just exactly the same as the rest of the range so twist cap two and a half twist and it's off and then it's to be posted because as you see then this is a small pen otherwise again as I said you can write with it like that it would be uncomfortable for me to do so for an awful long time but they've been designed to be posted they are pocket pens that have been designed for full functionality by posting the pen this way comes with a steel nib and if we have a look a little closer say so this is the fine nib it's a nice design same design as is on every Caveco nib as I said, and this is a fine version of these again like the others these twist out and you can replace the nibs and change interchange them if you've got more than one Caveco steel nib so this will interchange with the students and the um, the all-rounder the Dia you can move the nibs around So say 131 millimeters as you're looking at it now and it makes it a very nice comfortable writing pen for quite some time you can journal in this nicely you know it's not just for jotting some quick notes 
I love these and it is this one is the fa my favourite of this line the AL is my favourite these are £58 here in the UK which I don't think is too bad at all you know the AC is you know in the 90 sort of pounds because of the materials of the carbon fibre that's used in it but I think this is a good sort of middle of ground and you can really tell the quality of this pen so here we are we have the pencil now as I said mechanical pencil slightly thicker than this part of the fountain pen and then this simply clicks to work the mechanical pencil and then this untwists which pulls this in at the end here and then take this out to replace the leads in there easily obtainable then the replacement leads from the same sites so that's the pencil I don't you know I don't use many pencils but I really like the fact that I've got one on hand and it really matches really well with this I find so other than that I wanted to show you something else for some time because these are so small it's been very difficult to find a converter that fits I started off a couple of years ago making my own um, just using a an old cartridge and um, going from there really starting off from there I then started refilling cartridges with syringes works but messy you can change the skyline and the ices to eyedroppers with the use of some silicon grease and some o-rings but this I wouldn't do so because of the material that this is but they have finally brought out a piston converter there was a squeeze converter as I said but for me it didn't work well but this does work well it draws up just like as you'd expect you press this down I'm not going to do so now because if I press this down I'd have a big ink puddle on my daughter's white desk which she wouldn't be best pleased about and then you just literally pull this up and it draws the ink through the nib into this little barrel I do have to say however which was a shame because I really love Caveco and I've never had any issue with this sort of build quality but when this arrived this hole wasn't big enough it didn't fit I tried and I thought I was doing something wrong but it really didn't fit I did contact Caveco and unfortunately they had a batch that there was a problem with um, and they were sort of replacing them from there I actually all I did was just made the hole a little bigger and with a bit of sort of um, a bit of pressure as well it was and it fits now without any issue I just used a sort of biro down the top of it and just stretched it a little bit until it sort of fitted and it now fits really well but again it was just an anomaly of a sort of batch of them that came in and I was unfortunate to have one of those um, another accessory just I love these if I'm not keeping them in the little Caveco case and I'm carrying them in my pen pouch then I tend to use these little clips they're only about two pound here in the UK and I find them really useful then very functional and goes well with the pen so this is what we're going to be looking at as far as a giveaway is concerned I am always very grateful to the team at Caveco for loaning me the pens and they've loaned me this to have a look at and um, I used it very briefly um, but I didn't want to use it because I knew I wanted to do this as a giveaway to my readers and my subscribers and the people that follow me on Instagram and everything from there so thank you all very much I really do appreciate it you know I it, I don't take any of this for granted at all I really do appreciate it because it'd be very little point of me doing this if nobody actually wanted to watch the videos or listen to anything I had to say so as a thank you I'm gonna give this away um, this is a denim the new denim pouch range they brought out it would go really well with the, they go beautifully with all of them to be honest but they've got the denim the stonewashed version of the ALs as well in black and in blue and they've brought this out in black and blue this is the black version so if you have maybe a black pen or a red pen or any pens it doesn't matter they fit these very well so if you sort of think that we've got the pencil in here and then just take this clip off because you put the clip in it doesn't necessarily work if you want to get two in and then they're both in there and they're both 
soundly in there they're not going to fall out of there you know so it works really nicely if you want to put this in your coat pocket put this in your shirt pocket put it in your trouser pocket so you've got an extra bit of protection for these then they work very very well these retail at 26.99 here in the uk which isn't cheap for something that is as small as it is but this is genuine denim and this is genuine leather here where the Caveco is and it is very well made we've got this little stud at the back here with the Caveco logo on you can see so I'm really I've been really pleased with it I'd like one in blue myself I think but this is the black and I'm going to be giving this away so it is bank holiday weekend it is Sunday it is the first second of May so I'm going to run this for two weeks from today so I'm going to close this on the 15th of May midway through the month and then from there I will post a winner on my Instagram channel and I will get in contact with the winner as well myself so in order to win this very simple very simple process all you need to do is be a subscriber to my channel and leave a comment below for this video and then on the 15th of July I will randomly I'll use random.org or something like that to choose a number and then I will get in contact with that winner so if you've got any other questions please do let me know but this is said this has been the pencil the mechanical pencil and the AL fountain pen and the new denim pouch let me get that back into shop there for you sorry I was getting a bit carried away and I hope you found it useful as I said comment below and subscribe to my channel and I'll speak to you all very soon thank you bye bye